This hack tip is brought to you by Jack Threads. Welcome to Hack Tip, the show where we break down concepts, tools, and techniques for hackers, gurus, and IT ninjas. I'm your host, Shannon Morse, and today we're checking out cool application launchers. There are a lot of handy ways to open your applications in Windows, from the built-in quick launch menu to some of the desktop add-ons. Personally, I like something fun and animated, and while on Windows I can't use GNOME Docky Launcher, there are a few to choose from in the Windows OS. First off is one of my faves, Rocket Dock. This application launcher is animated and smooth, and it features full customization. You can even add taskbar support, which makes your taskbar minimized windows into icons on Rocket Dock. It features multi-monitor support, a drag and drop interface, which is great, auto hide, portability, yeah, you know how I love my portability apps, and it's free. So I'm going to go ahead and check that one out. You can download Rocket Dock over at rocketdock.com. And when you first download it, it comes with a whole bunch of built-in icons for my computer, recycle bin and whatnot. But it's really easy to get new ones over there. You can just drag and drop. So I can drag and drop my stuff, stuff folder over there, just like that. And I can also even minimize Windows and Chrome. So I could choose this one, for example. Minimized. So that Chrome window will show up in my Rock Doc. So it's very cool, it's very easy to customize it, and generally, I, I like it. It's nice and smooth. Next up is Stardock's Object Doc. There is an Object Doc Plus for about $20, but I'm going to focus on the free one just to keep it fair. Object Doc works about the same as Rocket Doc with very few differences. This one has some nice built-ins like the five-day weather lookout, importing your quick launch bar, and the ability to change the effects. They offer lots of customizations and options, which I am a huge fan of. So I can go down here and pull it up, and it'll auto-hide if I want it to. Whee! Um, I'm gonna change, let's see, I'll look at this, and I'll enter my location. Um, I'll do that one. Update. Then it'll bring up the forecast for my five days. How cool. Okay, so it gives me a lot of customizations, but as you can see, it does lag a little bit, so I don't know, that one might be my favorite. Hmm, still thinking about it. The third one I'm checking out is True Launch Bar. This one is a little bit different in a lot of ways. First off, there is a trial version, but after that runs out, you're supposed to pay 20 bucks to keep it. Yeah, no thanks. With True Launch Bar, you can customize a menu for your taskbar and drag and drop icons into it. You can also create tooltips, separators, and submenus. So let's check this one out. Now to open up True Launch Bar, you do have to go through a little bit of a menu. You have to hit right click on your toolbar, go up to toolbars, and choose True Launch Bar. And then just hit OK. So this last one actually integrates into your taskbar down at the bottom. And you can add on any kind of icons that you want to just by dragging and dropping them. So it's kind of nice, it's very simple, and it's, it's integrated, which is great. It's definitely different from the other two, but it has the same general idea. After the break, I'll let you know my favorite of the three, but first, here's a word from our sponsor. If you love alternative apparel brands like Kid Robot, Hurley, and Stussy, but you hate wasting cash, get this. You could score these premium brands at up to 80% off every day at Jack Threads, the invite-only shopping club for guys. They're serving up street, skate, and surfwear brands at brain-melting prices. Best of all, Hack 5's hooking you up. That's right, skip the wait list and join free at jackthreads.com H-A-K-5 to start saving instantly without having to leave the house. We're back, and my favorite has got to be Rocket Dock. With its smooth transitions and its super ease of use, I gotta say it's pretty awesome. I've always liked that neat Mac interface with the floating icon bar, so this is a nice add-on. And I didn't notice any difference in my computer's performance while running it. On the other hand, Star Dock Object Dock was slightly jittery on my machine. Do you guys have a different one? Send me a note in the comments below or email us at tips at hack5.org. And be sure to check out our sister show, Hack 5, for more great stuff just like this. I'll be there reminding you to trust your technolust.